ballistic engine to me as a long gun shooter is a must. I've played with many ballistic engines. Some of them are pure junk. All right. The real good ones have custom drag models. All right. That's what we consider is the next level. Something that we can really have something that that takes us and the, the, the clients that are buying it. The shooters take takes them to the next level very quickly because we give them perfect man. All right. So that that to me is the number one component right now. But then we come back in and we look at some of the other problems with G1, G7s. Good uh, ballistic engines that aren't perfect, they don't match up once we get out to distance. So all good or really good ballistic engines are pretty much equal, except some are easier. That's why we spent the last decade with Kestrel giving it easy buttons, making it easier and easier and easier. So some people say, Oh yeah, but this one will stick VCs and I can do all this crazy math and it's doing all this stuff for me. I'm like, well, what does that mean? So, I don't know, but it's cool. And I'm going like, yeah, but we can hit 1600 meters today with that 260 if we weren't already doing it. But now you don't have to know all that stuff. You don't have to understand it. You don't have to manage it because we manage it in the background. But if you had to manage all those points, wow, how are you going to gain all those VCs for all the bullets that you shoot? So now you're having to depend on the company to sell you a bullet or a BC and give you step BCs all the way up. We manage it in the background. We make it simple. That's what we did with Castro for the past 10 years. That's making it easier for the, for the consumer to give you those perfect holes. And that's what we're after. We want to make it easy for you to enjoy long range shooting. Not somebody that has to study for the next, you know, three months how to step your BC to get on, on target. We manage it for you very simply and it's never been wrong.